Day marks the unofficial start of summer, of course, and also the start of the best time of year for brunch, one of my favorites. Private Chef Mark Bailey is here with some rather patriotic ideas for the holiday. You're going to be with us all morning. Yes, Welcome. Yes, happy Memorial Day weekend. You Thanks as well. Me. So yeah. what's something to keep in mind when cooking brunch on Memorial Day You know weekend? what? You want to keep things simple, mm -hmm. and you also want to, you know, keep the red, white, and blue in the mix as Absolutely. well. Absolutely. Yeah, so I like personalized stuff, and, you know, the parfait, I'll start with the parfait because yeah. it's so great. Red, white, and blue, you got raspberries, blueberry, I use Greek yogurt, and for that crunch, I like to get on the bottom. I use uh, vanilla wafers. Vanilla wafers. Yeah. So this is super easy. Super vanilla easy. Wa tell them, vanilla wafer. Wafer, blueberries, green, uh, Greek yogurt, and raspberry. And so you have your red, white, and blue going the opposite direction. Very nice. <laughs> so it's cool. It's nice to hand these to, you know, your guests as they come in from a brunch or something like that. And what something easy that the kids can help with as totally, well. Totally, yeah. And then keeping with the red and the blue, I got a strawberry and blueberry crisp here that I've used honey bunches of oats to make. How, so know. how to tell us how you put that together. You know what? You just toss your berries with um, sugar, basically, you know. Mm -hmm. You can be any sweeter, right? <laughs> right? But you toss it with sugar and a little flour, what have you, and you use the uh, honey bunches as, as your topping. Okay. Kind of like with a little bit of butter and what have you. Bake it for like 25 minutes. You know, it, it really is delicious. I mean, this is the cereal the whole family can enjoy. This right. is the crisp the entire family will really enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but once again, great for a brunch. You can put it out and let everybody dig in. Very nice. Uh -huh. That looks good. This smells I know, right? delicious. Oh, <laughs> this, my God, I have to eat some of this I know. After. This is more of our breakfast in bed if you're getting up today and you're not really doing the whole festivities thing. Okay. Um, this is um, egg whites and Canadian bacon in a mug. And I love it because you can actually make it in the mug in the microwave if you this like. This is the mug here. Yes, okay. exactly. Yeah, so it's really great. You got Canadian bacon in there. And I use a little Swiss cheese as well to keep in the white uh, uh, genre there. Okay, and then you uh -huh. put it in the microwave. And then I make said. it in the microwave. Yeah, you'd be surprised. You can make it, you know, you can get those egg beaters okay. and you can really just make it real fast. Once again, breakfast in bed should always be quick and easy. And you easy. Know? Yeah, yeah exactly. you don't want to make a mess in exactly. bed for sure. So we were just showing the close up uh, of the these French little tub. kebabs. Yes. That's what I have my eye on. Tell me, <laughs> tell me how you made those. I love, I use shallow bread. You know, it's a little sweeter, mm -hmm. so I love using that for French toast. And then it's also great because you can cut it up real nice into inch pieces, uh, skewer them with some great sweet strawberry, and you're good to go. So you make the French toast normal like you mm -hmm. usually yeah, would? Yeah, with egg batter. Yeah, your right. egg, your little French uh, uh, vanilla extract, and just mm -hmm. the same typical things you would use for a French toast. But once again, the presentation is great, and it's great for a brunch. All right, and we have a shot of the menu, too, for the brunch that they're going to put up on the screen. Uh -huh. And then you just top that with some uh, sugar. Powdered some sugar, nice powdered yeah. Sugar. As if we need a little bit more, right? But yes, yeah, <laughs> sugar makes everything sweeter. <laughs> and a little bit of syrup on there, and you're good to exactly, go. Exactly, yeah. So this is all delicious. It smells really good. What are we going to have for us for the next hour? Oh, my goodness. We're getting into barbecue sides. So you're going to have, and it with a little island twist, too. So you're going to have uh, jerk coleslaw. We're going to have a lot of yummy stuff. Right. Looking I hope forward. you're hungry. Yeah, looking forward to that. <laughs> Stick with us. Sure. All right. This is CBS 2 News Sunday morning, and we'll be right back.